Temporal has just introduced the Task Queue Fairness feature. Before Task Queue Fairness, you were unable to tell Temporal, hey, these workflow or activity tasks each belong to a set of categories, and you should distribute tasks among these categories fairly according to defined weights. To make this more real, imagine you run a payment processor that many businesses use to process customer payments. And many businesses want to invoice their customers at the start of each month. You want to treat each business fairly and ensure they get their invoices processed with equal treatment no matter how many invoices they may be generating. This way, the customer that generates millions of invoices each month, say, a large insurance provider or utility, will not crowd out a local law firm, small gym, or freelance consultant, who each may only process hundreds of invoices due to their smaller customer base. With fairness, I can say these invoice workflows each belong to a category, in this case the business, and each category is assigned equal weighting, no matter if they're big or if they're small. To begin with, I'm going to run my fairness demo with the feature switched off. To show you how a handful of small businesses with a low amount of invoices are crowded out by large businesses with a lot of invoices. Because I'm not using Fairness, you can see that even though the small businesses don't need to process that many invoices, they're getting held up among the huge number of workflows that mega utility need to process. Because mega insurance has so many workflows to process, it's dominating the worker resources. At the end of the day, Mega Utility used most of the resources, processing invoices at a much faster rate, while the rest of the business's progress was very slow. And the graph shows that proportionally equal progress was made between businesses, but equal doesn't mean fair. Now let's run the example again with fairness enabled. Each of these fairness keys or businesses will be assigned equal weight. You can see that despite mega insurance having so many more workflows to process, this time the smaller businesses have their invoice processed at the same rate. Their relatively small set of workflows are processed quickly in the queue without getting stuck behind all of the mega insurance tasks. And if we go to the temporal UI, let's take a look at the very last mega insurance workflow that ran. You can see that the workflow's first activities were scheduled long before they actually executed. This is because we were being fair to the smaller sized businesses. Eventually, the final activities in the mega insurance workflow ran quickly after scheduling because other smaller business invoices had been processed by then. And so fairness ensures that you as the payment processor treat all businesses fairly, no matter if they're big or small, and protects the lower volume businesses from being blocked by the bigger ones. As of September 2025, Fairness is in private preview. For task queues that have it enabled, here's how you introduce it into your workflow code. I'm showing temporal Java SDK code, but we've released Fairness support in Go, TypeScript, Python, Ruby, and are working on other languages. My process invoice activity has been assigned a Fairness key. In my case, I'm using the business name. And a wait, which I'll set to one every single key to ensure equal treatment per business. There is no set limit to how many fairness keys you can define. So if you're processing payments for millions of businesses, then you can have millions of fairness keys. What if I wanted to designate some categories of tasks as more important than others? This is where weights become useful. Imagine boarding a flight. You might have hundreds of economy class passengers, some passengers on a standby list hoping to travel at all, and much fewer business, first class, and VIP travelers. Without fairness, any VIP traveler our tuxedo wearing folks in this image, boards with everyone else. Too bad if the VIP showed up late, they're going to have to stand at the back of the line. Task queue fairness allows me to assign weights to fairness keys. In this example, I've set up my VIP travelers with a weight of 20. Given the standby list travelers have a weight of 1, this is telling Temporal, treat VIP tasks as 20 times more important than standby travelers. Given economy travelers have a weight of 2, VIPs are designated as 10 times more important. In other words, it's like having dedicated lines for each traveler class, with the VIPs having many more people checking their boarding passes and passports so they can get onto the plane faster. Let's run my flight boarding workflows with this weighting applied to see what effect it has. 
you can see these VIP travellers are whizzing through the boarding line. The red line shows that almost all of the 20 VIP travellers have 100% boarded already. This has freed up the first class line to be processed with the highest waiting. You'll notice that the other classes are progressing too. Fairness means none of these fairness keys or flight classes are blocked from boarding. Finally, we see that the hordes of economy travellers are being processed roughly twice as fast as the standby list. Given economy has a weight of 2 and standby has a weight of 1, that makes sense. And we're done. Fairness gives you both protection for small tenants and proportional allocation assigned to business value. As I mentioned earlier, it supports millions of fairness keys too. So if you have use cases where you need to control the fairness of your workflows and activities on a task queue, then I recommend you try Temporal's task queue fairness feature. Thank you.